Hey y'all, listen, I'm here, I'm here, I'm late, but guess what, I'm here. Let me show y'all exactly what I was doing today. <laughs> Yeah, you see that? Yes, my husband and I just bought a brand new semi truck and he's very, very exciting. He deserves it, you know, he deserves it. But today I wanna to talk about Ephesians. It's gonna be real quick, but Ephesians 4, 22 and 23. And it reads that ye put off concerning the former conversation, the old man, which is corrupt according to the deceitful lust and be renewed in the spirit of your mind. Yeah, y'all. I mean, come on. Take off that old man. Take off it. Take off all your sinful ways. All the things you've been doing dirty. All the things. Everything. I'm talking about everything. Come on. We are commanded. We are commanded to do so. We are commanded to do so. Dismantle, okay? All of our old, all of our old sinful ways. All of them. When I say all of them, I mean all of them. You got to work on all of them. I know they ain't going to just be gone like this. Gone, gone, gone. Uh-uh. But I'm saying you have to work on all of them. Now, you know, I'm just not talking. Let me tell you why. Let me tell you why now. The reason why is because it's deceitful. They are all deceitful. The lust of the world is deceitful. And you already know what time it is. It's all a lie. It's all a, it's all a trick. You know, it, 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 it's a facade. You feel what I'm saying? Dismantle the old man. Those fleshly desires. Let me tell y'all something. Let me tell you something really quickly. The way you really do it for real. This is how you really do it for real. Change your conduct. Change how you talk. Change how you walk. Change your lifestyle. Change everybody in it if you have to. You know what I mean? You don't throw nobody away. But baby, if y'all doing stuff I can't handle, guess what? I can't handle it. I can't go with you, boo. So all in all, all in all, if you work on it, woo, <laughs> come on. If you really, really, truly work on it, come on. The renewing of your mind. We work on the renewing of your mind, baby. That's when the blessings fall down. Come on. The blessing. Look, the praises go up. Come on. Up, up, up. And then what? The blessings come down. Come on. What's up, y'all? So I'm pulling up for my job, and y'all know I'm trying to trying to watch my weight. I'm trying to do this with my husband, so I got my smoothie. You feel me? I got my smoothie. I'm trying to do this now. I'm trying to do this. I'm trying to do it. Uh, Friday, man. Friday. Friday. Woo, woo. Good morning.
pull it up. You just gotta stay on it. Just leave me alone. I'm working out. I'm working. I'm working. I gotta get some life insurance policy. Oh well, you you booked up, so I'm gonna do it. Don't worry, I got it. So late until twelve. So you got time to work on Mr. Duncan. He said I told him don't come here until twelve. Be on the schedule because I don't want people to just be popping up. Mm -hmm. What time? And and I'm calling too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like when you call back, what time you want her to? Uh, let me see what time she will call you back. You get what I'm yes, saying? Please. Because yes. what happens is people be waiting. Yeah. And if you're on, if you look on your calendar, you'll see I say phone appointment or over the phone or in the office. Yes. So you can you your I schedule can be better. Yeah. Yeah. Just space them out rather than have time. To yeah. Be ready for each one. And this phone been ringing crazy, but oh, I saw it. I saw it. Oh, but just let me answer. Just you know. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I got. It. And you know what I was thinking too? You'll get more work done and get your life done. You know, yeah. you start booking stuff if mm -hmm. you can. I was thinking maybe um we can make a proposition with your auntie for Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, for her to come out of your house from three to six, and we can get her on that teleride, and then we can if we want to start next year on the first, and then maybe she, you can work until six, five thirty, five o'clock. That's fine. I don't mind working. It's Monday, just, Wednesday, it's just when Jay like this and he get now he working. It ain't no. It ain't no joke. I can't. You know, if she go, if she willing to do it, that's fine. Yeah, especially if I can be, get on that teleride thing. Cause you need me here in the afternoon. I'm gonna need you. I guess I need my employees. If, 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 you know, even if it's just three days, you know, and then Tuesdays and Thursdays you can go meet the boys. But I need her to meet John. Next time I'm gonna pitch it. It's not really for JJ because JJ we don't get there till like five thirty. That's right. It's really for her to meet John. That's true. And they could change John too. John is almost to about four forty-five. So if she can get the teleride at um. I just it's got to have somebody there just in case you get there earlier. Yeah. Now, she can get a telephone, get her set up at 3. She can get your house at 3.30. And then she can get a telephone to come back and pick her up at 6. That's it. And then what that is, 3 to 6, 3, 4, 5, that's just 3 hours. And get her out of the house. And then it'll put her, to, it'll pick her up from the front of her door, take her to your house, pick her up from her house, and take her back from her door. And that gets her out too. You know, and it's only 3 days. She, might need, to, she might need to move that to 2 o'clock because, you know, that teleride yeah. be yeah. iffy. Yeah. Yeah, if she's on the regular bus, then I know she'll get there because they ain't going to the time. Yeah, I'm ready, but, but, too. but tell her, right, you all right? I'm trying to put my shoe back on. Oh, <laughs> I'm just walking my foot back because I ain't just rocking my shoe. Oh, but yeah, um, what was I about to say? But yeah, that tell her, right, uh, will be good. Mm -hmm. But I think we should schedule it at two. They should give her a good rate. They should give her a good rate. They should give her a good rate. And, and she ain't got to come every day. She just comes Monday, Wednesday. We'll talk to her. We'll see. Monday, she might do it. We got to get it done. So we need you on Monday, we need you on Friday, and it's on Wednesday. And then maybe Tuesdays, um, Tuesdays and Thursdays, and you can leave the ladies. You know? But then we can handle Kayla. You know what I mean? Yeah, between the two of us, we can get Kayla. But I'm just thinking that because I need my, I need you to get help, and I know Jason needs you too. I just don't, right now, I don't want you to over, yeah, because Jason really is, um. Oh, it's done. He told Dad this. And you know he got opportunity to. Just he passed that inspection. Of course he did. He passed the inspection. The truck bag. So yeah, the truck bag. Yesterday. Well, no problem. No problem. Okay. That was the biggest thing. So, okay. So and now what? What do you mean now what? He started to work the day tomorrow. No, they had to get the stuff yesterday. So they put all stuff in the system now. I started. Okay. So yeah. okay. He just got the inspection yesterday. He just got the truck two days ago. That's so they got to finish out everything. They got the tags and stuff. They got to, they got to get all that process. I guess it take like maybe a day or two for for this company to have get everything. But um, but he passed the inspection. So good. But yeah. So by Monday he be pulling them loads in. Hopefully. So listen, are we gonna do some content today? Are you gonna eat? <laughs> are you gonna do some content today? <laughs> Excuse me, can you record me real quick? Mm -hmm. Can you record me real quick? Mm-mm, get somebody else.